Set up in 1975, NHPC has the distinction of being the premier organization in the hydropower sector in the country, with capabilities to undertake all activities from conceptualization to commissioning of hydro products. This Schedule A enterprise of the Government of India with an authorized share capital of 5,000 crores and an investment base of about 10,000 crores today ranks amongst the top 10 companies in the country. To its credit, NHPC has successfully completed seven major hydropower projects in different river basins in the country, together generating 2,133 megavolts for power. These projects are Barasiru and Shamira Stage 1 in Himachal Pradesh, Loktak in Manipur, Salal State 1 and 2, Uri in Jammu and Kashmir, and Tanapur in Uttar Pradesh. NHPC has also completed the 14.1 megawatt Devi Ghat Power Project in Nepal. A number of projects are under different stages of development. Dulhasti in Jammu and Kashmir, Rangit in Sikkim, Bhaliganga Stage 1 in Uttar Pradesh, Javera Stage 2 and Parvati Stage 2 in Himachal Pradesh, Tista Stage 5 in Sikkim, Loktak Downstream in Manipur and Akoil Karo in Bihar, which when completed will together generate 3140 megawatts of power. Work is also going on at a 45 megawatt Kurichu project in Bhutan and 5.25 megawatt Kalpong project in Andaman and Nicobar on a turnkey basis. Many other projects are in the pipeline. In its endeavor to provide cheap pollution-free energy, NHPC has recently decided to develop wind and tidal power projects in the country. NHPC has taken up for development a 25 megawatt wind power farm in the first instance in the state of Pamenad. With over 24 years of work experience in the Himalayan mountains, which constantly spring new surprises in the form of soft squeezing ground condition, rock falls, tunnel collapses, and water ingress from perched water reservoirs within the mountains and even inflammable gases have given NHPC the ability to tackle any unexpected challenges with skill and ingenuity and to anticipate and provide for such surprises beforehand. NHPC's expertise in underground tunneling is at par with the best in the world. NHPC has high caliber in-house design and engineering capability, which is one of its major strengths, enabling it to undertake all types of engineering works related to hydro projects, right from concept to commissioning. The scope of its work includes all aspects of investigation, planning, design, construction, operation and maintenance of hydro, tidal and wind power projects. For geological investigations, an intrinsic aspect of all hydroelectric power development, NHPC adopts the latest tools and techniques to accelerate work with precision and economy. For actual operations in the field, 
NHPC is equipped with some of the most sophisticated state-of-the-art construction equipment and machinery. In fact, over the years, NHPC has acquired equipment and machinery valued at over rupees 160 crores, which is the single largest inventory of equipment available with any organization in the country. Some of these machines in the tunnel boring machine TBM, similar to the one used in the Euro tunnel linking England and France, the Alimac race climber, multi boom hydraulic drill jumbles, rock bolters, and short creating robot machines. NHPC has well equipped and efficiently manned workshops at every project site, which ensure optimum equipment utilization and minimum downtime. Materials testing laboratories further ensure strict quality control of all the materials used. NHPC has an elaborate information technology infrastructure in place since the early 80s, making it possible to bring together diverse functions, such as finance and accounts. Design and engineering. Project management. Human resource development. Commercial management and power plant controls. This elaborate information technology networking has facilitated quicker decision making at various levels of management for effective and efficient control of operations and financial efficiency. NHPC is now making available its vast experience to other organizations in both the public and private sector through its consultancy services in the fields of design and engineering, construction supervision and project management, investigations, etc. Since all hydroelectric power projects are located in areas of natural wilderness, environmental protection and conservation are at the forefront of all the hydro projects. Before the start of any project, NHPC conducts in-depth studies on environmental impact assessment and geosocio-economic studies. Regular studies on water quality, aquatic ecosystems and fish management are conducted. Proper remedial measures are incorporated within the project plan from the very beginning so as to maintain the native ecosystems in a pristine condition. As a part of the overall hydro project undertaking, huge tracts of catchment areas are also treated with anti-soil erosion measures. Compensatory and voluntary afforestation is carried out over large tracts in the catchment areas of the project. big is beautiful does not hold here. Even many and micro hydro projects are on the drawing board and a number of states have approached NHPC to develop the small scale hydro potential which totals over 10,000 megawatt of power within the country. The corporation has over 12,000 employees who are experienced in the construction, operations and maintenance of hydroelectric projects located in remote and difficult terrains. 
as a policy, regular upgradation of supervisory, managerial and technical skills of employees at various levels is carried out. Ever since NHPC started its commercial operations, it has been making profit. Various projects are working at over 100% of their rated capacity, and NHPC continues to maximize India has an identified hydro potential estimated at 84,044 megawatts at 60% load factor. But a bulk of this potential still remains untapped. It is NHPC's avowed goal to utilize this untapped resource. In fact, NHPC has finalized a very ambitious perspective plan under which over 43,000 megawatts of power will be added in the next few years spawned by water is sacred too. An environment-friendly gift of nature that will not only lend a healing touch to our heavily polluted environment, but will also help conserve our forest, soil and water resources, all of which are vital for our prosperity and well-being. The resources of NHPC are now focused not only on utilizing the nation's vast hydroelectric power potential, but also those of other renewable resources like wind and tidal power. With the ability to tame mighty rivers and to bore deep into mountains for NHPC, no task is too hard and no target too high. NHPC remains dedicated to provide cheap, pollution-free energy to the nation.